Going down south to Ackland, where investigations also continue into that double traffic fatality that happened around 9 o'clock Monday morning. According to police officials here in New Providence, our news team went to Ackland yesterday to follow up on the story. It's on this stretch of road between Snug Corner and Hard Hill Acklands where that island's double traffic fatality occurred early Monday morning. The vehicle in which two males were inside, seen here as a two-door gray Nissan, license plate number 251595, was mangled. Airbags deployed, engine totaled, and the inside destroyed. A team from the Police Forces Traffic Division flew to Acklands Tuesday to begin their intense investigation into exactly what happened. They combed the area and marked several spots with cones and spray paint to get a sense of exactly what happened. According to Inspector Harry Williams, it's still too early to tell. The information is still sketchy. We are on the ground doing some investigations here. But what we can share with you that two men were traveling in a northern direction and they would have lost control and the, ve and the vehicle would have crashed, thereby causing the accident. We, at this time, we can't say what is the cause of the accident, but we'll be able to bring that to you sometime later. As police conducted their probe, the bodies of the two men were retrieved from the morgue to be transported to New Providence. It took several men to do that job. And when the message got out that the bodies were being sent away, the victims' families lined the airport gate to see it for themselves. <laughs> Still devastated by the loss. Once the bodies arrived in New Providence, morticians were on hand to collect them. Meanwhile, police continue their investigation into this double traffic fatality in Acklands.